Good morning students. Today we are going to learn find the highest common factor by using long division method. In this method you remember these four steps. In the first step divide the greater number by smaller number. In second step divide the first divisor by first remainder. In third step divide the second divisor by second remainder or in fourth stage the divisor which does not have remainder is highest common factor let us see in a first example 108 297 so first you find the greatest number and smallest number so greatest number is 297 and 108 is smallest number so 297 is a dividend and 108 is a divisor so you write in this way 108 is a year and 297 so you know simple division uh, 100 in a 108 table you find the value 297 or less than value so here 108 to the we get here 216 16 in second place. So write here 2 and here write 216. Then do the subtraction. 7 minus 6 1, 9 minus 1 8, 2 minus 2 0. So this is the first remainder and first divisor becomes a dividend. So 81 divide 108. So again in 81 table you find the 108 value. You know 81 multiplied by 2. So we get here 162. But here you want 108 and less than 108. So you take here 81 on the 81 and then write here 81 on the 81. So do the subtraction. 8 minus 1 7. 0 minus 8 not possible. You take here 10. 10 minus 8 2 carry 1. 1 minus 1 0. Here remainder second remainder is 27. And second divisor is a dividend. So in a 87 in 27 table 81 is present. 27 is a 81. So right here 3 and right here. 81 and then again do the subtraction 1 minus 1 0 8 minus 8 0 so this is the answer when we get we get here remainder 0 and this is the in the last step divisor is a highest common factor here 27 is highest common factor so right here therefore highest common factor of 108 and 297 is 27 In second example, 252, 576. Same step follow. You first step find the greatest number and smallest number. 576 is the greatest number and 252 is the smallest number. So 576 divide by 252. So you write in this way 252. In 252 table, you find the value 576 or less than or less than value. So 252 to the 504, and then 252 to the 756. So uh, you want here 576. So in second place. We get here five hundred four. So write the write the value here five hundred four and here two. And then again do the subtraction six minus four two seven minus zero seven five minus five zero. Then uh, here write down seventy two and first divisor become a dividend. So again seventy two divide two hundred and fifty two. So again in seventy two table to find the value two hundred and fifty two or less than value. So again, do uh, do the multiplication. Seventy two to the one hundred forty four or seventy two three the two hundred and sixteen. Seventy two three the two hundred and sixteen. So right here two hundred and sixteen or here three. And then again do the subtraction. Two minus six not possible. 
12 minus 6, 6, carry 1, 1 plus 1, 2, 5 minus 2, 3, and 2 minus 2, 0. So here, 36 and second divisor becomes a divider. Then again 36 divided 72. And you know, we are 36 multiplied by 2, then we get 72. So 36 to the 72. So right here 2, or here 72. Then again to the subtraction, 2 minus 2, 0, 7 minus 7, 0. So here divider is 0. So last, in the last step, divisor is Highest common factor, so 36 is the highest common factor. So right here, therefore, highest common factor of 252 and 576 is 36. In third example, see here 126, 540. So again, you in a first step, you find the greatest number and smallest number. So greatest number is a 540 and smallest number is 126. So 540 divides 126. So again, write down in this way. So in a 126 table, you find the value 540 or less than value. So 126 multiply by 4. 4, 6, 24, 4, carry 2, 4 to the 8, plus 2, 10, right here 0, carry 1, 4 on the 4, plus 1, 5, 504. So, in a 4th place, we get here 504, so right here 504, and then do the subtraction, 0 minus 4, not possible. So, 10 minus 4, 6, 1 carry, 4 minus 1, 3, and 5 minus 5, 0. So here 36 is the reminder. This reminder becomes a divisor and first divisor becomes divider. Then 36 divides 126. So for you find in 36 table 126 or less than value. So 36 3 is 108. So right here 3 or here 108. And then again do the subtraction. 6 minus 8 not possible. 16 minus 8. 16 minus 8, 8. Carry 1, 2 minus 1, 1. And then 1 minus 1, 0. So 18 is a reminder. This 18 uh, reminder is a divisor, becomes divisor. And second divisor becomes a dividend. Then in 18 table, 36 is present. 18 to the 36. So right here 2. And then right here 36. And then do the subtraction. 6 minus 6, 0. 3 minus 3, 0. So, in the last step, 0. And then, in the last step, divisor becomes a highest common factor. So, therefore, highest common factor of 126 and 540 is, 40 is 18. Next step, next example. In a 4, 605, 935. So, again, here, 935 is the greatest number and 605 is the smallest. So, right, 605, 935. So, 605 to the 1210. But you want here, nine, less than 935. 935 and less than 935. So, you have 605 on the 605. So, 5 minus 5, 0. 3 minus 0, 3. 9 minus 6, 3. So here, 330 is a reminder. This is the first divider. And first divider, this is the first reminder. And first divider becomes a dividend, 605. So, 330 divides 605. So, 330 to the 660. But here, 605. And you want 605 or less than 605. So, 330 on the 330. So, right here, 1. And here 330. Then again do the subtraction. 5 minus 0, 5. 0 minus 3, not possible. 10 minus 3, 7. Right here 7, carry 1. 6, 3 plus 1, 4. And 6 minus 4, 2. So here second reminder is 275. And this value becomes a divisor. And second first reminder becomes a dividend. First, divide, uh, second div uh, divisor becomes a dividend, 330. And so, divide 275 divides 330. 
So again you find the value 330 into 275 table. So again 275 on the 275. Then again do the subtraction. 0 minus 5, not possible. So 10 minus 5, 5. Carry 1. 3, 7 plus 1, 8. And 3 minus 8 again, not possible. So 3, 13, 13 minus 8, 5. Carry 1. 2 plus 1, 3, 3 minus 3, 0. So here, reminder is 55. This reminder becomes a divisor. And this value, 275, becomes divider. Then 55 divides 275. In 55 table, 275 value is present in our fifth place. 555 multiplied by 5, then you get 275. So write here 5, write here 275. Then do the subtraction. 5 minus 5, 0, 7 minus 7, 0, 2 minus 2, 0. And then remainder, when remainder is 0, then in the last step, divisor is the highest common factor. So therefore, highest common factor of 605 and 935 is 55. In a fifth example, same process you follow, you understood, you see the video carefully and understood each and every step and you practice it. More examples, I am giving here four examples, you do it, 7, 7, 8, and 9 and 10, you practice this example in a... Thank you.